It's fixed already. No, I'm just kidding. That's actually not mine. That's Bailey's. I'm just testing it. <laughs> so cool. Dude, that's a glitch. Yeah, it never stops until you turn it off. <laughs> yeah. It comes back on. <laughs> when I'll fix it, it'll be fun to watch all three of them go around. Water? Uh, probably a little bit. Yeah, it's good in there. Close. Was the shock a bit bigger than usual or something? What? Is the shock a bit bigger than usual or something? Yeah, it's like three millimeters instead of one. Or two, I mean. Yeah. Huh? It's about three millimeters, right? Yeah. But yeah. Okay. We're almost done here. It's getting close to the size. Yeah, real close now. The screen actually came be attached from that. <laughs> but 
keep uh, put it higher up so it'll lift faster. Yeah. After resist though. Quality work pays off. What? I wasn't doing anything before. Yeah. After resist the uh, chain. What? I know what I did. I know what I did. I can't bother taking the car apart what? again. I know what I did. What happened? I did the wrong spin. Because now there's one to bring it back and there's one to bring it forward. So I'm, I did the one that bring it back, not the one. Oh. <laughs> God damn it! Alright, sorry. Uh, I'll, I'll fix it. No big deal. That's a small adjustment. <laughs> uh, this is when you're rushing. You shouldn't run. Never rush! Never rush when you're fixing things. You're gonna run into problems. Always gonna run into problems. <laughs> Oh. Hmm? No, that's fine. It's just oh. a little bit better here. Yeah. Yeah. fails guys, it fails, that's the nature of it. We'll do this lightly tap thing in there. It's for about close to three millimeter size, you can't really tell. Yeah. It could be better. And that's what happens. Split. So, yeah. <laughs> Do it right later. Wait, 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 show me what you're doing. Show me what you're doing. Drilling and then tapping. Is that the shaft that has to go on? Correct, yep. That's like a three millimeter shaft. Maybe four. Wait, but is it meant to go on the end only or? No, it's supposed to slide all the way up to the end of that pin. All the way in, okay. All right, give me, a, is it a 10 tooth gear? It's already split, don't worry about that one. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the gears? Gears. Right here. Mm -hmm. You got extra ones? Yeah, they're extra ones. Did you increase the size of the... Yeah, all you gotta drill? do is increase the size of the drill and work your way through. I don't have the exact size, so you just kinda kinda work with it. So is that the size it's meant to be? No. So but okay. you can work with it. That's what I did last time. So what I do? Grip down there. Just adjusting this part is a bit annoying, but once you get it on, just have to. Yeah, that's something I want to do. Well, I don't have another bit in between, so... Yeah, that's the point. See, if you had the exact part, that would work, but it's not going to work. There's no way. Well, that's, the, that's the largest one I got, so we're going to have to just buy a new one. Yeah, just buy a new one. That's not going to work. No way. 
Yeah, no way. And even if you do it like that, it's not going to be an even hole. It's going to be like one side is going to be slightly mm. bigger, slightly bigger than the other. So you need well, to get. Just gotta postpone it then. Yeah. So that needs. Like if if I was home, I'll just go. Zzz, zzz, done. Put it on. Done. <coughs> but yeah, yeah, bigger drill bit. I don't know how you did your one, to be honest. I did it patiently. I just took a lot of patience from that. Yeah, it'll be easy if you just get another drill and just go zzz, zzz, two times or something, and it'll be good as new. That's easy. That's that you can do this easy. You just have to get the right drill. Bit. You guys want to try it that way? It worked. I mean, it worked that one time perfectly, and it's still. Yeah, I just roll. tested it before you came back in. Doesn't it work? I let it roll around four yeah. times. Yeah. It does what it's supposed to do. Now we were. So that's the resistor we replaced there. Right yeah. there. So, um. It works. It works again. A lot of people will probably throw that away. Probably. It really works. Oh yeah, hot glue. This looks messy. I usually don't do this, guys. I usually um put heat shrink tubes so it looks nice and neat. Yeah. But I couldn't do that you know, because obviously he doesn't have the parts. I told you to go buy them. How can I buy them? Can I drive? Yeah, that's what I thought. I can't even drive. <laughs> Some people they don't know what they're talking about. Hey guys, this is the Jimmy Fan here on Jimmy Master Animatronics, and this is going to be a really cool video, along with uh, Jovian videos. Jovian videos, and uh, what we're going to be doing is restoring all three of the sex yeah. Santas. This one being the first one because it's one with less problems. This one right here just has a just tore wire and a to make the arms move and a split gear. And that's that's easy. I mean, it still moves, but it ticks, of course. So what I'll do is I'll reconnect well, or I'll re uh, solder all these most of these points to where they get good grip and then I'll yeah. replace the board. And this and is I'll... what it does right now. Oops. What the... Oh, oh I guess God it does it. <laughs> Let's redo that, all right? There you go. Yeah, see the arms don't move. The Sometimes... The hack job on the side there. there see, there's and, then, and it does move. Like I said, it's a tor... Yeah. The tor yeah. wire. That's cool. That's like... <laughs> yeah. I can't wait to fix these. What's wrong with this one? Wire, tour wire. wire for the arms and a split gear. Jenny? I don't know where the wire is that's tore, but... Oh my god, the circuit board is right there. Just the that, that, that's because that's not the way, only way it worked back then, but now it doesn't work like that either. <laughs> there, yeah, there, we go, there we go, there we go. Yeah. Yeah, okay, now it's stopped again. Yeah. I'll fix these. I want to see if we can, I can hear you guys in this video. God damn. Can't hear him that way. <laughs> oh, you can't a bit, you can't a bit. <laughs> They're already gonna know where you are, where you are. No, I See, I did that <laughs> accidentally, I accidentally did that. That's hilarious. Are you posting that in the group? Yeah. <laughs> Who cares? Yeah. No, yeah, but make sure you tell Jaden and all the people that know, tell them that do not tell if the comments ask, are you at Bailey's? Just say, not just don't them. acknowledge the comments. Yeah. yeah. Delete them or whatever. No, don't delete them, but just don't acknowledge them. Yeah, tell them not to answer back to the comments yeah. and stuff. Whoever. Explain this, guys. Yeah, we found something. Now, I actually knew this before because. One of my friends took apart these singing fish and it looked like this. It looked exactly this like that. This is the second gen, by the way. And the first gen, this is the original mechanism that came inside this, and Jordan never took this apart. No. Never. And this is how it looked like, like a regular Big Mouth Billy Bass mechanism. So, it looks like the second gens were changed, changed a lot. Yeah. yeah, show the back of that one. Well, you can't really tell because now this is a Billy Bass mechanism. Well, yeah, I know, but just show you can already see that. See, it's different. It's yeah, definitely see? different. Different um, board as well, I think, slightly. So, anyway, you get the point, but it's different. It really yeah. is. It really is different. Now, I actually took this apart because I want to take this extra piece of... Um, plastic. Plastic because it's annoying me. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, I just wanted to show that because yeah. that's interesting. That is interesting, yeah. Okay, so... Okay, what happened is that there was a simple wire that tore off here and that's why you had the board hanging out the side. So what I did is I readjusted all that, I, re I put new soldering points in it, made it stronger. At first it was malfunctioning, I didn't know what was going on with it, so I yeah, just kept redoing yeah. it and it finally, uh, finally stuck. And uh, here's the final, almost final result. Now I have to replace the gear in here, but it does work. Yeah. You can hear the ticking. Yeah. It's barely holding, holding on. But it, it, the razor's great. Look at yeah. that. One of the best ones I've seen. Yeah, all the boards back in place now. So. Yeah. That's why the wires come off. Because it keeps, yeah. Yeah. Why well, I re-hot glued all the but wires. That, remember, that Dollar General version is worse. That's why Bailey put that on that base. What'd you say? The Dollar General version. Yeah, that's, yeah. The Dollar General versions come in this box, so when you want to, are trying to buy a Saxon Santa, watch out for this, because you're going to have non-stop wires coming off on it's that. funny because the, I love the material of... Um, Dollar General's box. Yeah, the, the, the material of the clothes cool. is a lot cheaper. Again, it's Dollar General, but Bailey did this. This is a, like a hip swinging Santa mechanism, or I mean base. And he put the board down there and extended the wires. There should not be any more problems with it. Oh, wow. Plus, the speaker probably sounds better down there too. Yeah, lift it up. Yeah, because the speaker's in the base now. Because originally it's in the body, of course. Yeah, and you can tell, if it doesn't have the box, you can still tell because it doesn't have sparkles on it. This is the CVS model. This is the older one. Sparkles, better quality. Oh yeah, and here. Right there. Did the gear just come off? No, it's still. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it's stuck. It's jammed. Okay. There you go. So yeah. I'm gonna try to get this off. Yeah, I'm gonna show how to replace the gear because these are a little. It's the same. Surprisingly, it's the same, it's the same mechanism as the hat arm on the spinning snowflake snowman. It's the same exact mechanism, but the levers that so raise. Trying arms to get are, the head off, you gotta be careful yeah, with yeah, that. Yeah, you gotta get the head off, and the levers mm -hmm. are kind of a pain. <laughs> he's sewing. Oh. He's sewing a snowman. He replaced the split gear and the, the hips. And. Um, so this, is, this came off pretty easily. Oh yeah. Just pop right off, yeah. See, there's the inner mechanism it's there. It's the same as the snowflake spinner. It's just, the, just that. Yep. So, um, there are two ways to do this. There's one way, which is to take everything apart. And then there's the shortcut, which sometimes works, sometimes doesn't. Where you take the two screws right here, take the belt off, obviously. And you can take a flathead screwdriver and open it up slightly to where you can get your hands in the mechanism to replace the gear without having to deal with all this down here. Now that's what I'm going to try to do, but most likely it's going to end up taking everything apart. Because that's usually always how it works. The belt's actually good in this. Huh, good. Yeah, so you know residue? I suppose that wire's been off for a long time. Probably, yeah. yeah. It's definitely, I think, is this to probably 2000, maybe 2001? Maybe 2001, yeah. That's why I think it's 01. It could be 2000, though. I don't know. It's probably 01, though. Mm-hmm. Because I can tell on the your 2000 model over there. I th is that 2000? Those, 2000? Well, the black... Okay, that one's actually 2000, 2001. I got it a year later from the black so one. So maybe this is a 2000. Maybe this is a little older. Yeah, my black sure. one is a 2000. Mm. Just so you can, you can flip this over to get it out of your way. I have to get a lint roller on that thing. Yeah. <laughs> and then right here, they have to where you can get that out of the way. That's There's the speed, a speed, dial. speed dial to change the speed of the hips. Yep. You just That's stick if a you small, absolutely have to. Stick a small flathead and turn. Yep, but this one's actually in the middle speed, so it's perfect. Yeah. So no need in doing all that. Get these batteries out because they're in the, falling out any, anyways. And uh, see, so we started out with this. 
and we'll get we'll go ahead and take the long way just to show you guys the specifics yeah and you'll see these little pop tabs these are most most of the time they're pretty all easy hip, these all are, the hip swingers have this every single thing. one yeah see this one's actually being nice to me <laughs> coming off relatively easily now this one not so sure If you can get your fingers under there, you can get it off. Slide the two pins out. Please keep up with these. This is one of the less difficult ones because this is one that has not been tampered with or anything. Yeah. It's just kind of factory. And uh, show you a little inter inner mechanism area yeah. there. That's where the board is. Speaker, board. I'm probably going to put two dabs of hot glue on that speed those speaker wires because that yeah. happens. Yeah. And then uh, flip this over and it comes apart from the front. Just, your, just so you remember, the screw holes are facing the front of it, not the back. A lot of people mess that up. I get confused with that sometimes. Yeah. How you doing, Joseph? Is it done already? Mm hmm. Wow, no, that was fast. Hey, you can so your green went up now. Look how nice it is, you can't even tell. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> you can see my grandma coming out the door. Uh, huh? My grandma was coming out the door out there. I saw her in the background. I wonder if she's going to tell us to go to bed. <laughs> mm, probably not. Probably just seeing about y'all's clothes or whatever. Yeah, these people are staying here, guys, if you haven't catched the drift yet. These people. These <laughs> random people. Yeah. Strangers in my house. Which feels like we've always been together, <laughs> even though for me, for me it's been like four days. Yeah, four or five days now. Yeah, that's crazy actually. Already goes by quick, man. Ask Joseph; he's been here for almost two weeks. Yeah. Well, oh, yep. Go. <laughs> okay, so. So now what I'm doing is uh, you got I'm that shell the, off. Yeah, I got the shell off, and I'm just prying it open enough to get. Do you have to on. take the levers off? No, that's what I'm trying to avoid. That's what I did the first time. That's yeah, what I'm trying to that's avoid. The thing. Yeah. When you take the levers off, it's you, really it's hard. hard to, to, it's hard to get them to stay on. It, yeah. Like you'll put them back on, but they don't always stay. That's for sure. They, they they'll just give you. Remember like, my black one at first? It kept coming off. Yep. This is. I mean, it's not the best way because it puts a lot of stress. So if your mechanism is yellow, do not do this. Yeah. Um, just take your time and just go the long way. But since this mechanism is actually fairly decent condition, I can... Oh, and you already got the bell piece out, huh? Yeah. Where's that split gear? You already got I it I took out? it out right there. Takes an eight tooth? Yep, an eight tooth. Where is... What I'm going to do... Which one's this? Is there a... Um, See, it's split uh, right there. How outlet? Over here? Where? Over there. Yeah, no. it's, uh, it's behind that white, the orange ghost and the snowman. Oh, well, cool. that's the Jingle Bell Rock one, I think. Yeah. That one won't work, but... Yeah, you can use that for now. What I usually do is put a tiny, tiny dab of hot glue to hold this gear into place while you're putting it in. So it won't... I mean, obviously, it's just, so it won't slip everywhere. <sighs> And damn it. That's what happens. Now you hey, gotta go find your gear. This real quick. Sure. Oh, wow. Jeez. The motor's still a bit seized up, that's why it's making a little bit of noise. But it works great. <laughs> Perfect Tucson. Yeah. Try that again. I wouldn't be able to do it that way. Unfortunately, I would have to do the long way, which is take the levers off. Results. Oh, 
I like the way you're doing it. Yeah, just put a little dab of hot glue to hold your joint in. There you go. It's a, wow. I don't think that would have worked. It's a good for technique. Me. I just learned to do it. Well, what's wrong with it? What happened? The just is split just here. splitting. See, this was the. Well, no, this was the original one. See, it was already split. And see now, now that you got that shortcut, it's all back together and ready to go. Why'd you put a knee gear on there? Yeah, just a new eight tooth. So what was the hot glue for? To hold it in place, like just pop it in place. So I don't have to maneuver. Yeah, because otherwise you would have to take off the levers, and those yeah, see, don't, that's those don't stay on once it. you take them off. <laughs> oh, fair enough. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah, I'm I, I've never yeah. done these before. So. Oh yeah, these are. That's why I didn't do it. <laughs> yeah, I just want. I've just done so many of these dang things. It's just I've learned these shortcuts. See, there you go. It's uh, it's all good now. Hey, it took the batteries out. Oh yeah, it did. <laughs> And now it's ready to reassemble, isn't that fun? It doesn't always go this smoothly, folks. No. No, it does not. Especially that Dollar General version. Yes, I've had to fix it. You constantly have times. wires pulling off every second. That's why you see it on the base now. <laughs> yeah. But at least that didn't scrap how many? It. How many times did you fix that one? The at wires? Least, just it, the wires. Just the wires itself. At least seven to ten times. Seven, then, I think every wire has pulled off on it, I think you said. At Just one the, point in time, yes. Um, the first day I got it, it just had a simple split gear in the arms, like this. And then it escalated to the speaker going out. Soldered the speaker. The, the hip swinging arms, I mean the hip swinging function went out the wire. And then after I fixed that, the uh, arm wire went out. <laughs> so it's just, that's exactly why you see it on the base. I said, I'm so tired of this, but I also don't want to scrap it because it's still cool and it works. So I put it on the base because no one has ever really done that before. And it, and it works. Yeah. It works great, actually. <laughs> He's enjoying his two songs over there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can't believe that technique works so quickly. I know. You know? Took one, took two times. But I, yeah, yeah, I'd have to do it the long way, though. I don't think I'd do it that way. It wouldn't work natural. for. It wouldn't work for me. See, the Santa likes me. He's like, oh, the Jimmy fan's fixing me. I heard about that guy. You see, your mechanism's all back together. No levers are coming apart. Not yeah. going anywhere. And um, fortunately, the rest of them aren't going to have that issue. It's going to be a little bit more complicated because all the levers yeah. have all been uh, messed with or taken apart for repairs. Which were successful to an extent. Just, you know. Actually, it's been like three years since you repaired that black one. Yeah, when it's. So, yeah. so it lasted. This one, guys. Oh, man. Arms. Arms all screwed up. Wire off speaker. Plus, the motor doesn't move because the gearbox is from the harmonica sound, and for some reason, it's not working with that. Oh, I don't know why. Yeah, you viewers haven't realized these Santas are my specialty when it comes to repairing. Some things I know, seems like I know everything about. Some things, like the fish, I don't know as much about. And that's Joseph's cup of tea there. One day, I'm going to make a video of how to sew things properly so you don't see it when you sew it back together. That'll definitely be useful. That'll help. So, because, you know. Obviously, you want to sell it good. You don't want to sell it bad. Indeed. Um, I don't remember where that was glued. I don't even know where that was glued, but... I know that's the slot for the wires, so... Wait. Oh wait, never mind. Oh yeah. So. It should go to back together pretty decently. And there you go. I think. There you go. Oh, it was glued right here. No. Oh. Yeah. Now you put your screws back in here. The suit's kind of in the way, but yeah. No. 
I guess this will be like a three-part video of all the three different Santas. Yeah. Or something. I'm not sure. It's gonna be quite a few parts. Yeah. All this. But put these in in particular in the restoration of the Santa video. Yeah. So people know. I really like the Rocky the Lobster restoration. Yeah, I can't. I can't wait to see that. Oops, oops, oops. Oh my god, why does my phone screen stay on now? I'm gonna glue this little guy back on here. Put the wiring back. Like so. I'm gonna put two dabs right here just in case. I love sewing, man. I love it. Yeah. It, that gives it the final touch. Yeah, because you know you're done and it's... The stress about fixing things are over. And you're on your way to enjoying the item. No, but not trying to be hard at us or anything, but like... When you're good at it, it's better as well. Yeah. Because like when you know what you're doing, it's a better experience altogether. Yeah, because right now it's sewing up very nicely. Like we can't even tell it's been sewed. And after this, you just slide your pins back into place. See if you keep the pop rivets, you can pop them back in. And if they're easy to come off, they should be easy to go back on. Like so. Same thing goes for this one. Just gotta line the holes up there. There you go. And that shouldn't go anywhere. Just in case you can tighten them up a little bit by pressing down the, on the little bits there. You really want to. Hope you guys are enjoying these restorations so far. Yeah, I hope you're watching them all too. Yeah, like, a lot of work. Because they're lawn, but. They're well worth it in the end, though. Looks good. Everything's really pretty much back together. Mm -hmm. Now you can start reassembling it. Oh. What? Got a knot in the string, so now I have to start again. I hate it when you get a knot in the string. That's got to be a pain. And you fold the coat back over, which should be pretty easy most of the time. These coats are flexible. Not to put too much stress on the arms there. Don't want those snapping. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely need a lint roller for this thing. Yeah. You uh, peel that back to expose. Um, probably need to velcro that just a little bit to fit your head back on correctly. Should that go back on pretty easily here? Came off a certain way, it'll go back on. There we go. See, I got lucky in this one because it went pretty easily for me. It didn't give me much trouble like some had yeah. in the past. So I hope you guys learned a lot from this. I know I did. Just have to. 
Don't tighten these too tight because the um, the tabs may snap off, which happens a lot on these. Yeah. That's why the heads are all wobbly on some of them. Oh, uh, bro, I feel bad. I'm talking to the video. I just realized. Doesn't matter. They know you're here, so. There we go. We got a little bit more now. The weather outside is bright. This. I don't know why I use those batteries. That's the problem with these ones. When they have slightly low batteries, the yeah. hat doesn't go all the way oh, and they I don't know. perform as well. Yeah, I hate it. Let me see how well this guy works after uh, a few minor repairs. So he's got a new gear in the arms and his wires are reattached. <laughs> Hold on. It's doing that again. No, no, it's moving. Oh, there you go. It's just caught. Sounds a lot healthier. Uh, sounds better. For the pants up. I thought no, you liked oh the well. Take it. They're down. <laughs> That's Jordan style right there. We're, we're gonna keep it down. Keep it down. Do what you do what you say to me whenever I tell you to keep them down. We have to pull them up. No, we need them down. No, oh, we have to pull them all the way hiked up like that with the shirt tucked no, in. Make sure you super glue it. So yes. It doesn't touch yes, it again. I'm super gluing it. What if the wire comes off again? Oh, that's just too bad. You yeah, <laughs> still have nice pants. <laughs> but what if you pull them down? Well, that's another story. <laughs> I pulled them so down. So here's how you pull the pants up. Um, <laughs> this is how you pull the pants up. <laughs> Because uh, someone that I know that owns these doesn't do that. He just Don't likes me, them down. I wonder who that is, man. Yeah, oh. what a douche. <laughs> Even his poor Santa's just sitting they there all violated. They work better with down, but, you know. You violated your Santa's privacy. That's true, Jordan. That's not fair. They, they probably feel very insecure already. and <laughs> You just have to exploit them in front of everybody like that. You need to go back down. No. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I'm gluing it. I'm showing Jordan how I'm gluing the pants. <laughs> like, hot glue the hell oh, I'm hot gluing it, man. Maximum strength. See that little line of hot glue? We're gonna recreate that. <laughs> and they're not gonna. Yeah, let's make sure the arms still work. Let's do that again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll fix that when I'm done gluing the pants. Are you kidding me, man? Oh, uh, I see what it's doing. What? Every time it's on this side, it doesn't. Really? I think. I don't know. Maybe it's just the motor that's going bad as well. I'm not sure. Well, um, you always run into problems, yeah, guys. always problems, man. Thank goodness Jordan told me to yeah, check it because I told now you. we have to take them back down again. <laughs> the pants are going down. It's time to reinvestigate this cancer we got here. <laughs> they don't always go smoothly. They really don't. How it's doing this again I have absolutely no clue but you know what that's okay I don't think that's okay to be honest it's not <laughs> I'm just saying that to comfort the viewers it really sucks just don't lose your cool because it's all gonna be done <laughs> why, don't you just out? <laughs> why don't you just stab myself and then just start swearing <laughs> 
You know what, guys? Fuck this. <laughs> nah, just, just be patient with it and you'll eventually get there. This video is trying his hardest to, like, make it I'm trying to accommodate to the viewers, yes. Yeah. It's okay, guys. We're, we're, we're gonna we're gonna fix this, man. We're gonna fix this little mess we got here. This little bastard. <laughs> Pull the pans out again. And if they don't come all the way up the first time, do it a little bit more. <laughs> and if that starts to piss you off, just throw it away. <laughs> <laughs> There's always ways to handle these. Oh. You know what? I didn't put the spring back. See that? I didn't put the little spring back. Huh. Oh, yeah. Well, see, that's also why I didn't hot glue the board back into place. Because now I can take it out again. Because we somehow have to uh, go back and work on this garbage. Garbage. Absolute garbage. Oh, now it loves to work, huh? Yep. <laughs> uh, he's just working away. <laughs> working away. Oh my god. Yeah, raise those fucking hands, Santa. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm just trying to make this a little funny for you because I'm frustrated. <laughs> it somehow just has to work when it's out of the. Yeah, that's Guess why I have to yank it out the side and just leave it there now, huh? <laughs> yeah. That's, that's what Jordan does what he does, yeah. <laughs> I have way I have reasons why. Oh yeah, he that. has reasons. Don't question him. Cuz he will teach you a lesson. Who is? All it is, there's no explanation of just being a bitch. The Santa? Yeah. Yeah, he is. He's being a big you know, do, you think, do you think there's a tour wire? It's I don't know. Yeah, somewhere. You know, I would say the zip tie is a great idea, but I also think it's kind of snagging the wires. Zip tie? Yeah, see oh, that yeah. zip tie? I just feel like it's just snagging them. Like, oh, shit. Oh, I need to shift that off. Language what? Joseph. There Excuse me! Children Shut watching. your mouth. Shut your mouth. <laughs> Anyways, um... These, this red and green wires are for the head. As you can see, I already put a dose of hot glue right there to keep it in place like it was originally, but I guess that didn't help. For reasons I have no clue. The reason is you're just bad. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> so we need to do check both spots check this head because that could also be a problem which I don't think it is personally because it was already hot glued so it couldn't have yeah. been strained any there and then down here I probably just need to crease these soldering joints Let's see how that works I don't know probably need to cut the zip tie and do it again why is my camera not working? stop it? okay yeah. 